his prayer. And because he's the prayer answering God. And we just thank God for the service. And after we pray, we go, we go have communion. And after communion, we go have a praise and worship service. About two or three songs from our wonderful minister of music. And you all going to participate by clapping your hands. Yes. Hallelujah. By waving your hands. By stomping your feet. Because God is worthy to be. Worthy to be. Worthy to be. We here to praise who? God. We here to praise who? God. We here to praise who? God. Praise Him in the morning. Praise Him in the evening. Praise Him with the sun. Hallelujah. 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 Father, we thank you. We praise you. We magnify you. We look forward to what you're doing in our lives. Oh God, we just thank the Lord for we take this time of prayer. Take this time of prayer. Because Lord, we know that you hear our prayers. We are believers and not doubters. Oh Father, we thank you for this opportunity to pray. We thank the Lord for this opportunity to intercede for, for not just ourselves, but for those that are our loved ones. Those that have asked for prayer. Those that are on our prayer list. Oh God, we thank you. But let the words of our mouth and the meditation of our hearts be acceptable in your sight. For Lord, you are our strength. You are our redeemer. God, we thank you for helping us all to have the ability to spread worldwide. To not just not just in these four walls, God. To have a global ministry. To have a global anointing. To have a global appointing. To have a global God. Oh, Father, we thank you. For this opportunity, Lord, that we don't think just how far we can see. But, Lord, we know that you can do the impossible. We know, Lord, that you can do more than we ask. More than we think. More than we can imagine. Oh, God, you can do it. You can do it, God. But, Lord, we can do all things through Christ who strengthened us. Because we are strengthened by your Holy Spirit. We are strengthened by your power. We are strengthened by your anointing. Oh, God, we thank you. How you bless our wonderful speaker today. Yes, God. How you bless her. Yes, I know her, God. In the name of Jesus, we thank the Lord for being with her. Yes, oh, we thank the Lord for loving and caring yes, for us. Yes, and that we listen yes, intently. Listen and get instruction. Listen yes, to know your truth as it spreads. Yes, oh, Father, we love you. Yes, we praise you and magnify you, God. For you are God and there's no other. You have no rival, you have no equal because you are God. And we thank you, Lord, for your loving kindness, your tender mercies, and the glorious name of Jesus. For, Lord, we know it was your blood that was shed for us. We know it was the blood of Jesus that was shed for us. We know, God, that, Lord, as we do this in remembrance of what you said, God, we do this in remembrance because you died. He was buried, and you rose again for our sins, God. We thank you. Oh, God, we just appreciate you, God, for everything, every strike, every battle wound, every situation, God, that you said is finished. And we thank you, Lord, that you rose with all power in your hand, God. And we thank you for sharing that power with us. Thank you. You didn't, you didn't leave us powerless. Oh, Father, we love you. We praise you and magnify you. Thank you, Lord, for your loving kindness, your tender mercies, and your forgiveness in our lives. We thank you, Lord, for everything you've done. Thank you do for us in the name of Jesus. Amen, amen, and amen. I know it was his blood. I know it was blood. Oh, yeah, yeah.
all night long. Yes, he did. They whipped him all night long. Amen. He was he was so messed, he was so his body was so messed up that it wasn't recognizable. He was recognized to be a man. But we thank God that by his stripes we are here. His body was mutilated. Yes, God. His body was was despised. Yes. Oh glory to God. And the enemy thought he won. Yes. But he did it all for us. He did, he did it all for you. Yes, he, did. he did it all for me. Yes. Oh, glory to God. He did it all. Yes, did. Glory to God. And so, as we take this little loaf and we break it, because his body was broken for us yes. as we eat it, and his blood was shed running down. Yes. And we take this, this wonderful little juice that we have in remembrance of his blood, and as we drink it, Mm. Glory to God. Because I know it was his blood. I know it was his blood. Father, we thank you. We praise you, magnify. Thank the Lord for loving us and for caring for us in every way. Thank the Lord for your forgiveness, for your kindness, for your strength. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Amen.
right there. Just keep on playing that. Just keep on playing that right there. Just, just in the middle of the work, spirit of worship. Uh, uh, come on, keep on. Just keep yes, it up. Yes, yes, yes. Come on. Now, while he's doing that, I want you all to do me a favor. Do yourself a favor. Don't do me a favor, but do yourself a favor. Wherever you are, I just want you to get out in the aisle. And I want you to start walking. I just want you to start walking. Hallelujah. Yeah, yes, it's burning. Yes, you got me walking. Yes, you do. I want you to know what? Just hold on, do whatever. I want y'all just to start walking. Thank you, God. Just wherever you are. And I want you, because it's not what it looks like. It's like just walk, just walk around. Just walk, just walk around. Walk back. Just walk. Thank you, God. Everybody just walk. And when you walk in, you walk it into your neck. You're walking into your, you better walk in, you better walk where about that, just walk. When you're walking into your next, just walk into your next. Walk into your next battle. Walk into your next battle. Walk into your next battle. It's not what it look like. It's not what it feel like. I walk into my answer prayer. I'm walking into my answer prayer. I'm walking into my answer prayer. I'm walking into my answer prayer. God, you know what I'm Right now, God, he's an old time God. He's a father. He's a, he said, 
every day. I will send you fresh manna. I'm not going to give you manna all manna. But I'm giving you fresh manna. I'm giving you a newness of life. I got about something. Yes. And I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you. As God, I thank you for this day. I thank you for these people. I thank you for this opportunity. I sit down and God, you stand up. Uh, you the one move how you move. Uh, you do how you do. Uh, we didn't, oh God, uh, we came into the door expecting. We came into the door expecting. We came into the door expecting. We expecting a mighty move. For those that are not even here, uh, we're covering those right now. In the name of Jesus, uh, God, we thank you. You have your way. You have your way. You do what you do. Uh, you let us know over here on Artesian Street. Over here on Artesian Village. Uh, over here in this here campus. Father God, you have forgotten about us. Father God, you're moving here in us. In us. In us. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, if it's a one day revival we need. Uh, it's a one day revival we need. Boost you again. Whatever you need from the Lord. Whatever you need from the Lord. Don't you know him? He knows your name. He knows your name. I say he knows your name. I say he knows your name. He knows every hair on your head. He knows you out of all. Fill you some people. He knows who you are. He knows what you need. In the atmosphere. There's a shift in me. There's a shift in my expectation. There's a shift in my life. There's a shift in what God is doing. God, you have your way. God, you have your way. God, you show yourself stronger. Show yourself stronger. In my life. 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 I want you to know. Thank you, Lord. Any kind of block in my mind. Glory. Any kind of block in my spirit. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Any kind of offense. Well, well. I lay it aside right now. Uh -huh. Because there's been nothing that's going to stand in the way of me getting all that God has for me. He's giving me a goal. He's giving me a goal. He's let me know there's greater. There's greater. There's greater. There's greater. Don't you know? There, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Come on now. It's for you right in this moment. There's a stirring of the water in this moment. Don't you see the angels? There's a stirring of the water. Oh, you ain't got to wait for nobody to put you in it. You're well able to put yourself in it. You're well able to put yourself in it. No, because there's a movement. There's a special anointing in here. Oh, don't be afraid to dream big. Bishop said dream big. He said that you're not boxed in. What that, 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 that limited expectation. God said, I've opened up the windows of heaven. I, I pour you out a blessing. Meaning you've been faithful. Huh? You've given your tithe. Huh? You've been here. Huh? You've been halfway. But God said, huh? right now I hear you. Huh? Right now I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. When you're kneeling by the bed, I hear you. When you're standing in the bathroom, I hear you. When you're looking in the mirror, I hear you. When you're driving along, I hear you. When there's nobody else but you and me, 
I want you to know I hear you when you're on your job site. I hear you. Don't you know I hear you when you're walking alone? I hear you when you're sitting there. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. You in a room full of people. But I hear you. I hear you. Oh, yeah, you were sitting. You think it's past your mind. But God said, I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. Don't you be afraid to dream it. Don't you be afraid to seize on it. Because I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. Wherever you are, trust in the Lord. And do good. Oh, hallelujah. You may be seated in the presence of the Lord if you can. Oh, trust in the Lord. And do good. Keep that steak. I need that feel. Like you just keep that there for me for right now. Just keep where you were. Just keep that. That's, that flavor. That flavor. That flavor of worship. I need a flavor of worship. There's a flow. There's a flow. There's a flow. There's a flow. I'm trying to think about it. You know how a river be flowing along. I'm letting you know that that thing that we have here in our teaching Christian Center, if y'all look over on that wall, huh, do y'all see what it says? Huh? I want everybody to look over there, huh? look on that wall, huh? and I want you to say it with me. Huh? It says I'm flowing. Huh? In what? What are you flowing in? Huh? I'm flowing huh? in the very favor of God. I say I'm flowing. Oh, in the very favor of God. I want y'all to see. Y'all see what it says. It says I'm flowing in the favor of God. God did you see it, Bishop? It says I'm flowing. Did you see it? You see it? You see it, you see it over there? Follow me. You see what it says. I'm flowing in the favor of God. You can't stop it. When I'm in the flow, you can't stop it. I'm flowing in the favor of God. I'm flowing. In the favor of God. I'm going where God's favor will take me. I'm going where God's benefits will take me. I'm flowing. Oh. If God got to give you a whole program just for you to be able to get what you need, he'll do it. If God got to move uh -huh. in other ways, he said, I've never seen it done this way. But I'm going to do it for you. I'm going to tell you, huh? if God got to defy what the doctor said, huh? if God got to defy what the, the baker would say, huh? if God got to defy what the naysayers would say, he said, I'm going to do it for you. 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 Your haters don't dictate this. Your haters don't dictate this. The gatekeepers don't dictate this. Thing that was they used to say here 
Now, when there was, you know, their trouble is not in your set. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Come on, y'all. Clap your hands. All right. It's all right now. Praise God. Hallelujah. But I'm telling you, do not adjust your set. Uh -huh. Come on. The trouble ain't in your set. That's right. God said, I've caused a disruption. Mm -hmm. So that I can get a message to you. All right. He said, this is... The sound from the emergency broadcast oh, system. Uh -huh. We've interrupted your regularly scheduled program Come on, Come on, so that you can hear a word from the Lord. Come on. My God, my God. From the Lord. All right, all right, all right. We've been talking about a survival kit. Uh -huh. And I'm letting you know there's been an interruption Go ahead now. in your comfort zone. Yeah. Come on. There's been an interruption yes. in the way you got comfortable in doing things. Yes, yes, yes. God is saying, uh -huh. ah, you better hear me what I'm saying. Hallelujah. You may have taken it lightly, but I'm letting you know it's close. Who knew last week we were talking relevant? But now we're over into this week. That's right. The governor of the state of Georgia has, has declared a state of emergency. Well, well, come on. The governor of the state of Florida has declared a state of emergency. Come on, come on. Why? Because there is a sense of impending destruction. Uh huh. Man. Those of you that's on the coast, he said, listen, those in Taylor County, he said, I want you to get out of there because uh, uh, right now it's voluntary because you got time. And for those of you who realize it, who understand, there comes a time when there is no more time. That's oh, right. Come on. My God, my God. What you talking about? Sometimes they'll let you know. If y'all heard it, y'all seen it, y'all watched it. This is nothing new. We're talking from last week on Survival Kit, right? Uh -huh. And so there have been times when you know you get a long, what they call a long range forecast. Well. Anybody know what a long-range forecast is? Mm -hmm. A long-range forecast is that there's a tropical depression or there is something that's out there. Uh -huh. Brewing. Uh -huh. We don't know what's really happening, but it's out there brewing. Then later on, they come and, and then they start saying, it looks like it's taking shape. Yeah. Somebody say taking shape. Taking shape. shape. But then you're getting these warnings that's letting you know that we really don't know what's happening, but if it continues on this path, look like it's going to do this, that, or the other. That's right. And you go about your day, and you go about your life, not really paying very much attention. Well, man. Although there's been warnings going on, out, but you're not paying much attention. That's right. People of God. And so after a while, it gets closer and then begins to look like something. And after a while, they give it a name. And when they give it a name, those of you who look real close, that means it's formulated into something really real. Because they gave it a name. And I'm looking at you, looking at you, looking at you, and looking at you, and telling you sometimes there is something out there. It's been growing in the back, but now it's come close enough that there's a name to it. All right. Come on, children, people of God. But I like to tell you this way. God is not one that leaves us out there. What do you say? Hopeless. That's right. We're not like those who have no hope. That's right. We're not like those who are just left at the behest of whatever happens. He's given us a way of escape. That's right. Come on now. I say he's given us a way of escape. A way of escape. Now, this is the part. When you get those announcements, and when they say, this is, you go ahead and evacuate now. And what they call uh, a voluntary evacuation. That means we ain't not making you do it right now. It's a voluntary evacuation. That means go ahead and get your stuff together. Go ahead and board up the, the stuff. Go ahead and get your sandbags. Go ahead and get yourself right because it's not right up on you because you're looking up and you see sunshine. Well, 
Come on, somebody. You're looking up and you see sunshine, so it feels like everything all right. Truly, there can't be a real storm about to come because it's all, look at all this sunshine. All right. But there's a but they keep telling you when you look at the 6:30 news and the 6 o'clock news and, and all the hear the things that's been telling us, go ahead and get it together and get on up out of there. This is what you do for your survival kit. Make sure everybody knows, make sure you got enough water, make sure you got enough this, make sure you got enough that, because there is. This natural, y'all, this natural is so that you hear. This is how the world, the secular way, have gotten us equipped and understanding that you're not going to be kept unaware. That's right. Somebody said the schools of Doherty County are closed. Is that right? Or the schools of Leon County? No, the schools of Leon County, they're closed. I got a notification. I'm sorry, let me get y'all all happy. The schools of Leon County. <laughs> That's right. They got notification. My daughter say they may not take a lap because they say they gonna the, 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 the state is gonna be closed. Because they are getting now the sun is shining, but they getting ready. Yeah, they yeah. Spiritually speaking. Come on. All right. Come on. Spiritually speaking. Spiritually. What's happened is there have been warning signs all over the place. That's right. But the sun is shining. Uh-huh. So I'm feeling all right. But God and all the spiritual army is telling you, you need to be ready. You need to get yourself together. Together. Because I, you are at a point in time when you can gather and get enough oil and you can get some extra oil. Because I'm telling you right now, you're going to have to use your oil. That's right. You're going to have to use your oil. You know, we preached on last week about uh, Matthew, the 25th chapter. Uh -huh. And it said that the five were wise and the five were foolish. Amen. Those that were wise took their lamp and took extra oil. Yeah. That's people who are mindful to what they hear. That's people who are very astute to what's going on. Well. But then there were those that are foolish. They had all. Somebody say, but not enough. But not enough. What is that representative of? That's folk that still think they got time to play. That's folk that's not taking life too seriously. But God is selling, and they, 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 they got all, but they don't have enough. That's right. So they're, they're living vicariously, and they're, they're living very foolishly. They're not doing the things that, and what it takes that, that you are. Uh, 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 I'm giving you a fair warning. Put your finger up. There's a shift in the atmosphere. A shift. And I'm giving you warning that you need to make some moves and you need to make them now. That's right. I don't want you running out of time. Because those of you who know quiet as is kept, God got his eye on you. That's right. God doesn't want anybody lost. That's right. Take it on. Listen, listen. Tell, tell yourself. God doesn't want anybody lost. No, 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 no. And that includes me. Amen. He doesn't want you left out there unprotected. Amen. Somebody say, that's me. That's me. There's a scripture that says in Romans 8, 28. For us Bible scholars that really know what that says, what does that say? What does it say? All things work together for the good. Say that. All things for the good of them the love the Lord and those that are called according to his purpose. Now let's take a minute. Y'all don't mind, do you? I'm, on, I'm, on, I'm, on, I'm not going to overdo it. Do you hear me? There are things that happen in your life that just seemed strange. Amen. That it absolutely doesn't make sense in your natural human brain. All right. Amen. Because quiet as it's kept talking about, it looks a little bit dysfunctional. Uh huh. I don't know why I keep calling you out this day. But it looks, it seems a little dysfunctional. It seems like this don't make not a hill of being a sense. That's right. Come on. And I start saying you out that whole sentence right there. This don't make no sense. No. 
no sense. No sense. And then you go like, does this make sense to you? Matter of fact, you even having a conversation about it. Come on. You're going like, this don't make no sense. No sense. This is absolutely ridiculous. Uh-huh. And look at the person next to you and say, it, it, it is. It, it is. It is. It is. It is. It is. But you know what the word says? What it say? I'm gonna make it work. For your good. Amen. All right. Amen. I'm gonna make it work for your good. Mm. Thank you. Do you know sometimes you can get pushed off the porch Come on. Right. just before the tree hit? Yeah. Uh-huh. That's mm. right. Sometimes you can be in a place and something your something out of your lap drop and you duck just before the bullet come across there. Because had right. you been sitting straight up, the bullet would have hit you square down. Right. But for some reason you bent down. For some reason, you leaned over. That's what you call grace. That's what you call grace. But I'm letting you know that God got every one of you under the sound of my voice positioned for greatness. Amen. I receive. Y'all don't hear me. I receive. I'm going to tell you. Every one of you that's under the sound of my voice who's listening online and listening here, God got you positioned for greatness. greatness. It's whether you will seize the moment or not. Amen. Whether you will seize the opportunity. Hallelujah. Let me tell you about opportunities. A window is of opportunity is only open as long as the window is open. Because once the window closes, the opportunity. Man. That's right. You got to get it when the window of opportunity is open. open. Because the time frame doesn't wait on you. That's right. It's not an open ended time frame. It's not. That's just the way it is. Why? It's not. As it relates to certain things, you got to move. Now, that doesn't stop sometimes when we don't move. God, later on, something happens. But sometimes you don't get the later on. All right. So my thought is, my sheep know my voice. Amen. And a stranger, they hear him. That's right. Amen. And my prayer has been, Lord, I hear you, and I move yeah. how you say move. Amen. Amen. Yeah. There's this, there's this, um, there's this secular song, and I hear it going on in my head. When I move, you move. And I move you. <laughs> Sister Joanne, you know what the name of it. I don't know the name of it. Sister Joanne know the name of it. Sister Joanne know. I know Sister Jane. Sister Joanne, Miss Minister, Minister Nunley be looking all innocent. She know every song coming out. When I move, you move. Right. Just like that. When I move, you move. Right. Just like that. When I move, you move. Right. Just like that. See, Sister Kim even know it. Where you get it from, Sister Kim? Right. Minister. All our ministers know that song. And I'm saying. <laughs> But there's something in the say. When I move, you move. Uh-huh, and what you say, Kim? Just like that. Just like that. All right. Just like that. Mm-hmm. Now I'm telling you, this, this, y'all, what God is saying is hot off the press. Uh-huh. Because I couldn't find my notes. Get that right. Come on, Holy Come on, Spirit. Now. Come on, Holy Spirit. I couldn't find my yes, Come on, Holy I could not find my notes. Come on, Holy Spirit. I'm looking at you. But God said, I'm fresh now. Come on. All right. The day is a new day. The day is a whole new day. Amen. Yesterday is, is not for today. Come on. It's what I got for you today. Amen. So God is saying, when I move, you move. Just like that. When I move, you move. Just like that. When I move, you move. Just like that. You better say it. All right. And what God is doing, you have to be sensitive. Because you're flowing in the favor. Flowing in the favor. I, I want y'all to pull that. You're talking about your survival kit. You're talking, you, you, see, you got to remember, my mindset is everything. That's right. I'm, I'm going to let you know, Bishop uh, Mac Miller, our, our, our home bishop, he used to always say the battle is fought and won in the mind first. That's right. That's right. If you can straighten the way your mind is, it's going to move everything else. Thank you, Lord. It's going to shift everything else. And, and, and when you put that, your, your spirit is joining. Come on, somebody, because you remember, you're just a body. Hallelujah. Your spirit and your soul is the real everlasting thing. It's just, this is just a, a, a vehicle by which the energy is in. Yes, 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 yes. Because what's in you can shift. Yeah. What's in you can can shift the molecules of whatever because 
God is in me. Y'all wonder why when you walk into a room, everything changes. <laughs> because it's the God in me. All right, now. <laughs> Why is everybody always looking at you? Because it's something that's in you. Glory. I don't know what it is, but it's something down on the inside. It's something about you. You show up and everything changes. The haters wake up. Come on, speak, Holy Spirit. Glory. Speak. But see, the haters wake up because you got something for the haters. You got deliverance for the haters. Amen. Come on. It's, only, it's only blame them if they don't reach out and get what's Amen. in you. Amen. Because see, sometimes we take offense. Yeah. We take offense at something happening and we're taking offense. Don't take offense. Glory. God say it, sister. You give God glory for it. Amen. Because you know why? Because something in you is going to be speaking to what's in them. I'm telling you, they get to be stirred all up because they're like, what is this? <laughs> Let me tell y'all something. The scripture gives an example of when Jesus was walking through. The enemy, the demons began to like, like, what do you have to do with us? Come on. Come on. They began to tremble because they knew what was coming. And then the, 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 it, it, it was a disruption because they understood who he was and what was in him. I'm going to tell y'all right now, Come on. the opposition has no chance with the God that's dwelling in you. Glory to God. Thank you. Whatever the ops are. Amen. Did y'all hear me? I said whatever the ops are. Thank you, you are fit to deal with it. Only thing that can derail this is negativity. Mm, come on. I want y'all to hear me. I'm teaching a word for you today. Yes. Yes. It's negativity yes. in all its forms. Mm. I'm teaching a real word now. I want y'all to hear this. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? I say negativity in all its forms. Your justified negativity can disrail it. And what do you mean by that? Sometimes you know you got every right to be upset. But I'm telling you, don't go there. That's right. Come on, speak, Holy Spirit. You don't hear me. You're justified because this, the aggravation of the moment is what it is. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Isn't it right? Yeah. Don't feel good. It's not fair. It's all of that. You, you see it for what it is. There's even an acknowledgement of it. But you don't dwell there because your victory is not in the negativity. Amen. That's right. Now, y'all, that's a tall, mature word, but you don't hear what I'm saying. God said, I give you peace. You're talking about a survival kit. Peace that surpass all understanding. What does peace do? It guards your heart and your mind through Christ Jesus. That means it ain't in your flesh that it's done. It's through Christ Jesus. The Bible says here in Ephesians 6, which is where we stopped last week, it says, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole one of God. That you may be able to stand in the evil day. That you may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. That you may be able to, remember we talked about what wiles were. That is deception, delusion, fraud, deceit. All of that. But I'm letting you know. It's the God in you. That stands in all of that and dissipates it. What? God. What? Come on. See, this is where we miss it. Sometimes you are absolutely justified to feel the way you feel. Well, I ain't taking that from nobody. Sometimes you justify to feel how you feel. That's right. Yeah, they stupid. Yeah, the situation is dumb. Uh huh. With a B, dumb bum. But you don't prove it in the negativity. That's right. Now listen, you take this and I'm giving it to you for free. It's when you the positivity of God. Glory to God. That positive energy. It says love overcomes.
overcomes a multitude. The love of God. That's right. Hallelujah. Yeah. Glory to God. Yeah. I want y'all to hear me. You all are not lost. Even when you're dealing in a strange situation. Glory to God. God wants the best for you. Uh -huh. And God is showing, going to show himself strong for you. Yeah. In the point of this survival kit, as we here now, because we, when I said, you know, sometimes you run out of time. Mine is to give you this warning so you won't run out, that you will take advantage of the situation right now. That's right. That you will make moves right now. That you will, but that you will, that you will adjust your set right now. That you will, that you will make the adjustments that you need right now. Right now. Y'all, I'm telling you now, don't wait for the most op op optimum. Just do, just say, Lord, nevertheless, at your word. At your word. At your word. Nevertheless. Somebody say, I've been fishing all night. I've been fishing all night. But, but because of what you say, drop it again, I'm going to do it again. Uh -huh. Y'all understand the power in that. That's the, taking the uncomplication out. But nevertheless, that's your word. Let God prove himself to you. Amen. Let God work the work in you. Let's don't compare it to nobody else. Let's deal with what we got to deal with right now. I hope that word sinks in. I hope it sets right now with you. I'm telling you, God is there to do a miracle with you in your life right now. Standing all over this building. I'm letting you know. God, that survival kit. You're wise. You're wise. You're not foolish. You're wise. That means you're making moves right now as a wise person. You're wise. You got extra oil in your vessel. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm telling you right now. I hear it. I hear it right now. Do you not know some of you have made when you were bringing your uh, 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 tithe and you was putting it in the basket. You was laying up a foundation right now for a time such as this. You were laying up for a time such as this for, for when you need God to stand for you. Right now, you 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 got enough uh, 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 built up. That you can do just like Hezekiah when he said, when he turned his face to the wall, they said, Lord, didn't I? Didn't I? Didn't I? Did not. Did not. Did not. And God said, Yeah, you know what? You show sure right. You show sure did. Before the prophet could even get out of the gate, he said, Turn around and give him another word. Uh -huh. And I'm telling you, some of you have been just that dutiful. Didn't have to do it. But God said, you know what? I'm a God. I, I'm, a God. I'm a keeper of covenant. I'm a covenant keeping God. Yes, he is. Yeah, Kim. God said, I'm a covenant keeping God. You think that God, you, you're so adamant about doing what God wants that you think God is going to forget you? No. I'm letting you know you don't accept the word of the enemy trying to put that in your left ear. It is it's a lot. God said, I got you. He said, I got you. I got you. Watch me work. I got you. I got you. Release it. Let the negativity go. Yeah, 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 it's justified, but let it go, let it go, oh, yes. it's justified, thank you, Lord, because it's stupid, it's just as dumb, <laughs> but, <laughs> but I have my survival kit, I'm strong in the Lord and in the power of his mind, y'all better hear the word that says, be strong in the Lord, I didn't say be strong in, 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 in Patricia. No. Be strong in Bishop Edwards. No. Be strong. I say be strong in the Lord. Yes. So when I'm submitting this document, I'm doing it in the Lord. Yes. When, I, when, I, when I step and do this, I'm doing it in the Lord. Yes. When I'm making this next move, I'm doing it in the Lord. Yes. 
and in the power of his might. Because I don't have the ability, never, nor the wherewithal, to be able to dot all them eyes and cross all them teeth. But who is? God. Listen. God is the joy, he's the strength of my life. Yes, he is. He moves all pain, misery, and strife. He promised to keep me, never to leave me, never, never come short of his word. I've got to fast and pray, stay in the narrow way. I keep my life clean every day. I want to go with him when he comes back. Come to far. God is the joy. God is the joy. I'm short of his word. I've got to fast and pray. Stay in the narrow way. I keep my life clean every day. I want to go with him when he comes back. I come to him. One more time. God is a joy. God is a joy. The strength of my life. He moves all pain. Promise to keep me, never to leave me, he'll never 
God is my all in all. Hallelujah, God is my all in all. If he's not your all in all today, you need to give your life to Christ and make him your all in all. Hallelujah. Because to start off this survival kit, you make it. Make sure Christ is in your life. Make sure that you have been forgiven. That you have been forgiven. That you have been forgiven. Ask God to forgive you of your sins. Ask God to come in your life today. Oh, glory to God. Don't worry about your family members. Don't worry about who's sitting beside you. Ask God to come in your life today. Because God is a good God. Oh, glory to God. He's a good God. Father, we thank you, Lord, for this opportunity. Thank you, Lord, for this opportunity of prayer. Thank you, Lord, for this opportunity of knowing that you are working. Whether we put all, whether we walk around, whether we run, whether we kneel, God, you're working right now in your people, God. Oh, God, we feel your power. We feel your presence. Oh, God, we thank you, God. We thank you, Lord, that by faith we believe and we receive yes. what you've given us. Yes, God. But, Lord, you're so good to us. Yes, you're better to us than we deserve. We thank you, God. Thank you, Lord. But, Lord, we appreciate you so much. Yes, you're so good to us, God. So good. Oh, we thank you, Lord, thank that you, Lord. we give you glory. Glory. Give you honor. You and we are. give you praise. You praise. And, Father, we thank you, Lord, as we take this time to pray over this offering and this night. Oh, God, we just thank you, Lord, for you bless your people. Not us, but you. Lord, you open the windows of heaven and pouring out blessings. Thank oh God, you, you that, 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 that men will give unto us. Yes, God. Good measure, press down, shake it together, and run it over. Should men give it to our bosom? You said it, God. You said in your word, Lord, that we are believers. We are believers. We believe your word. We believe what you say. We believe what you've done in our lives. But God, you did it once and you'll do it again. And you'll do it better. Better. Oh God, we look forward to higher heights and deeper depths. Oh God, we're looking forward to those things that you bless us with, God. And not only be able to, to, to pay off our houses, to pay off our cars, but to buy somebody else a house, buy somebody else a car. Oh God, we thank you, God. We've been able to do what we need to do, God. Oh God, we thank you. Thank you, Lord, for opening the windows of heaven, Lord, that, that we don't look to our just uh, paycheck. We don't look to our businesses. We look to you, God. Because you're the author and the finisher of our faith. God, you are a provider. Yes, Lord. We don't look to our retirement check. We don't look to this and we don't look to that. We don't look to our savings and bank account. We look to you, God. You, God. Lord, you lead and guide our lives. You, God. We don't look to whether we in bankruptcy or whether we this or whether we that. We look to you. Come on, God. Because this is a new day. This is a new day, God. We thank you, Lord, for this new day. Thank you, Lord, for how you bless your people. Yes, God. And Lord, we love you. We praise you, magnify you. Yes, God. And Lord, we thank you, Lord, for blessing them. Coming in, coming in, going out, going out. In the city, in the country, in, the country. in their fields, yes, in their in their in their homes, yes, in their businesses, yes, in everything that they put their hand to do, yes, like the for promotions on their job. Promotions. Oh God, we thank you, Lord. Thank you, God. We thank you, Lord, for your loving kindness, your tender mercies in our lives. Yes, God. We give you glory, honor, and praise. And most of all. We thank you, Lord, for that wisdom, wisdom knowledge, knowledge, and knowledge, understanding and how to deal with the very wealth of this world. Yes, in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Thank God. Thank God. Thank God, Brother Lawrence. We appreciate you all. Glory to God. I know it was his blood. I know it was his blood. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We used to, we used to, we used to sing this song. Give what you give. Give it in Jesus' name. Remember that? Give what you give. Give it in Jesus' name. Give what you give. Give it in Jesus' name. And the Lord will bless you with some more. your offer.
offer that you gave. Mm -hmm. See, I waited till after you gave, because I know you gave something big. But I, I want you to speak this over your offering. Mm -hmm. Because the bigger you gave, the more you receive. And I thank God for it. And, and, I, and see, I, I, I want you to stand and repeat after me. Say, Lord, Lord, I thank you, I thank you for, opening up for opening up the windows of heaven. Windows of heaven. Thank you, God, thank you, God, for giving me wisdom, wisdom, wisdom to handle, to handle all, the billions, all the billions, all the millions, all the millions that come across my path. They use it they use wisely into your glory. Thank you, God, for blessing my business, blessing my job. Blessing my family, blessing my retirement in every way. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 That's a good God. You gotta speak over your you gotta speak. Speak life. Speak over, over your life. Speak it. Speak it. You gotta speak it. Speak life. Speak life. You gotta speak life. Oh glory. People give different ways. You got electronic giving? You got all kind of ways to give now. Oh, glory to God. But we thank God that speak life. And when you praise, praise God for what he's done. Amen. And also, praise God for what he's about to do. Don't wait till the battle over. 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 Wait till the battle over. Wait till the battle over. Shout what? Now. Shout what? Now! Shout what? Now! Shout 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 so we appreciate you all. Don't so go. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about what you've been through. And I'm gonna tell you something. You talking about healing and deliverance? See, some of us not being healed, not being delivered, but we eating the wrong thing, drinking the wrong thing, going in the wrong places we don't need to go. We need to change the diet. Oh Lord, God. Hallelujah. And see, that ain't no word of prophecy. That is the word of wisdom. Yes, 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 yes. Don't be talking about you got high blood pressure eating all the fried chicken, all the hog mouth, all the hog right. 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 all the chickens. Right. 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 <laughs> <laughs> you talking about my blood pressure. You need to change your diet. Amen. It's a word. It's a word. It's a word. I told the doctor, I said, I'm going to eat weeds. <laughs> And I started eating a lot of grass. Glory to God, help me. Come on. Glory to God, help me. Like, thank God I had a good checkup last time I checked up. Very good checkup. And I'm looking forward to getting off of this medicine. Come on, Glory to God. I thank God for it. Glory to God, we have to change. You can't stay the same. Say that, say that, fish. Eat all that greasy food, drinking all them sodas. Oh, let me get off there. Drinking all that milk. The slits. Oh, glory to God. Oh, glory to God. And, 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 and having that private communion. Glory to God. <laughs> but God is a loving God. Yes, He is. Glory to God. Make it, make sure you do the right thing. Amen. You only got one body. Take care of it. Take care of it. You only got one body. Only one. You only got one body. Now you can get them. You, I know we we get 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 around with one leg and one arm, whatever like that. But I I like I want all of my parts. And everything functioning well. Amen. And I thank God for it. Amen. Thank God. Give our pastor a hand today. We thank God for her. She looks so lovely and nice. We appreciate her. And let us stand. Oh, we got the announcements. Oh, yeah, announcements. That's right. We thank God for our prayer.
We have in prayer at 6 a.m. Uh, um, every every Monday through Friday, 6:30 on Tuesdays, and our family night will resume. And then we thank God for family night. And in September, on the fifth Sunday in September, uh, we we have the church have been invited. My, myself and the church have been invited to Smith Station, Alabama. Uh -huh. That's the fifth Sunday afternoon after church. We want you to come and will we want to ride over there to Smith Station, Alabama. We just need to know how many. Amen. So we can make preparations can be made. Hallelujah. We want to, everyone to just make come on a task. Um, Minister Nunley with getting our list together to make sure that we know um, all that's going to be going. We just need to know the number, okay? We just need to know the number, and the Lord say the same with provisions so that we can make provisions ahead of time on how we're doing if we can move as a unit. Amen? Amen. Also, be on the lookout that um, on on Tuesday, we're going to do Sanaya's trunk party. Sister Yarbrough was on live. So Tuesday at family night at 6 o'clock, Make sure to bring your your items for Sonia's trunk party. She's getting ready to go on um, to move on campus, Albany State University campus, and um, she's one of our youth, uh, one of our and we just want to be a blessing. She has a um, whole a lot of different things. A lot of you have already signed up, but if you haven't signed up on her list, so that we'll know, because we want hopefully by the Lord we're able to get everything on her list. And she has little simple, so a lot of simple things, Chick-fil-A gift cards, jewelry, just little things, extension cards, just little things. So if you haven't signed up already and there's something that you can be able to um, sign off on, please do so that when we look on here, I hope that um, what everything that not had been checked off by the time on Tuesday um, at 6, we'll have all these items ready for her. Um, for her to move in because she moves in Friday, um, Thursday, I think, is the day she moves in. So we want to hope that the Lord said the same that on Tuesday we fill up her trunk, her moving trunk, with a whole bunch of good items. Amen, somebody. Amen. So we thank God. And also on second Sunday, we're going to ask that our ministers, our leaders and ministers and new members, that you all be here at what's 9:30 on um, second Sunday. Nine thirty. What time do you get here for pre-service on Sundays for our leadership? Oh, nine thirty. Nine thirty. Nine thirty. Nine thirty on next Sunday. New members and leadership. Thank you. Hallelujah. And we thank God for you all, and and uh, we appreciate all that that you participate in, and all that you contribute, and all the prayers and the as a thoughtful gift that has gone forth. But we thank God for you all. So look at it. This this look around and say thank God for you. Thank, thank God, God for you. you. All right, thank all right. God for you. We appreciate it. I pray you. Thank you, God. Let us stay. You need me. We're all a part of God's body. Yes. Stand with me. Oh yes. Agree with me. God. Thank you.
name of my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. If you over sin, if you over sickness, if you over anything that's not like you, thank you, Lord, for forgiving me, for saving me, for filling me with your Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name, amen, amen, amen. God loves you, you, and especially you. Have a blessed and wonderful day. Wonderful evening. Thank God for you. We love y'all. We love y'all. We love y'all. We love y'all. We love y'all.